Hello, I'm uh, Hootie from HootieTuts.com. Going to make a grunge type creation here. Let you watch what I'm doing. This is uh, pretty popular nowadays. Uh, we have a uh, background fill layer and uh, and the man. Uh, it's just a tube uh, layer. Uh, I like to uh, make it black and white. So go to hue saturation and make the man black and white here. You can see that? Slide the saturation all the way down and it gives us like a grayscale, but uh, we still keep all our colors here. Uh, let's uh, take a texture and copy that. And uh, let's see, we'll add a new layer to our image here. Control. So we're going to select all and paste into selection. And uh, then we're going to remove the selection. We're going to change this to probably overlay. Yeah, overlay looks pretty good. Uh, that already looks pretty grungy. Uh, I like to use the eraser. It's pretty big. I could use the eraser to erase out parts that I want to remain visible and clearly seen. Um, that's one way to do it. Another way is to take the pick tool or you might have the deformation tool. And we can kind of warp this a little bit here. If I can grab a hold of it. Make it kind of half there. See if you take my classes, you know how to do this warping with vectors and stuff. Let's kind of go like that. That looks pretty good. I still want to race part around his face there. Let's get his face a little bit clearer. Not ready to mess it up just yet. And we can add another layer here. Let's see, grab a hold of a gradient. So I got that looks pretty good. So I got a couple. I got a couple repeats on this. Then we'll go with that. And use our flood fill and flood fill it. Got to change the layer blend mode on that. Let's see, let's use. Yeah, soft light looks pretty good on it. Kind of gives you a different type of texture on there. So, add another layer here. We'll grab a different type of texture and copy it. I'm using Control C. And Control A to select all, Control Shift L to paste into selection, and then Control D to remove the selection. And let's see what we got here. Uh, soft light. I'm using the wheel on my mouse in order to change the layer modes. I like the soft light pretty good. Okay. And again, we'll take the eraser and we'll erase out some of this stuff here. I kind of like that around the hair. We'll leave that there. Let's see. Let's get some of his body back in here again. Let's go back to our other uh, texture and layer. We'll remove some more. If he's all gooped up, why well, then we can't tell what the image is now, can we? But just kind of racing some stuff here. Let's see on that gradient. I'm going to take out part of that line on that gradient, too. That looks kind of funky, don't it? OK. 
Okay, let's add another uh, texture layer here. Control C to copy. Go back to this. Control A. Control Shift L to paste it. Control D to remove the selection. Let's see what we can get here. Well, got a couple different ways to go. That, that looks good on the background. That's a hard light. Just raise some of the funky stuff on that too. But not too much. Let's leave a little in there. Don't know. I think I kind of like his shoulders to show a little bit more. Keep on adding layers and doing the same stuff. Up. Let's uh, choose another gradient here. I'll add something else. Just well, I'll just pick something just for the sake of doing it here. Let's change angle on it. Find something. Ooh, that looks pretty cool. There we go. I like that pretty good. See, it looks a little bit dark over here, but that's kind of neat, too. And uh, that's pretty much the way you go about it. Now, uh, there's more things that you can do, such as uh, adding brushes and stuff. I'll add a brush while I'm in here. What the heck? Type in B, which is my shortcut. And uh, let's see. Yeah, that looks good. Uh, every time that you add something to uh, to one of these, you want to make a brand new layer, so you have freedom of uh, adjusting things. Let's see, let's. Oh, that's putting that gradient in there. Don't want that. Let's swap around. Try something like that. That's pretty cool. Again, using the eraser to erase out. Race up parts that uh, don't really want on here. See, I got a lighter set. Let's use a lighter. Single pass light. Yeah, one of my presets here. And that will leave part of it showing. Take away these hard edges here just by wiggling a little bit. Make it blend in a little bit better. And uh, that's the way you go. Over and over and over again. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial. And join us at HootieTuts.com. we got a button there for you to join our classes. Be glad to have you. Uh, if you're a beginner, that's fine. And uh, if you're an uh, intermediate, that's fine too. We can help you out. I'm sure we will. If you're into animations or blends, we can do that. Come come check out our site and click on the Join Our Classes button. And uh, thank you for watching my little tutorial here.